Some people love it. I look forward to it. It brightens up our, our February. I think it's a special day to spend with your loved one. Others dread it. It's a corporate holiday. We don't like it. Nevertheless, American consumers still rushed to stores in search for gifts for their significant others, with this year's Valentine's Day spending expected to rise 32% compared with 2019. Bostonians were looking at both expensive and little gifts for their partners. I just bought her a Nest Hub and a laptop recently. A vest to wear and then some candy and a card. I bought her a dozen roses, of course. But some decided to take it up a notch. A total of 2,330 Google searches mentioning the phrase how to propose were conducted between the beginning of the year and the eve of Valentine's Day. Bostonians had mixed feelings towards the idea. Yeah, I think I could be really cute. I don't know if I would want to have that day sure. shared with so many other people. It's way too cheesy, and but it's good to propose near a holiday so you don't forget it. Is it really? <laughs> That's a guy's opinion, yeah. but I think it's really what the day is, it's a special day, so I, you know, whether it's Valentine's Day or outside Valentine's Day, it just needs to be a special day for the both of you. Valentine's Day might be over, but Bostonians are saying that their celebration of love will continue. It's Damien Burkhardt for BETV10.